Hey, so what's going on everybody? So I have a little issue here with the Google Motorola Nexus 6 phone from AT&T. As you can see the logo there, I just got it today in the mail and I've done everything online so far and it shipped with a new Nano SIM card installed already. So it was supposed to be ready to go, but I'm going to show you guys when I powered on what's happening here. And I've already been on the phone with AT&T about this and they're telling me it takes some time and that it's on their end. But I discovered a few things in here like that. The Android logo coming up. And then that, that pops up. And I don't know if you noticed at the top, there was like some indication of, I don't know if it was a SIM card that wasn't working or what's going on here. If anybody knows what this is, please leave me a comment in the comment section. I am not sure, maybe later I will figure it out I tried to do a backup and reset, that didn't work. I did, um, I went into fast boot and did a, a reset, a hard reset, that didn't work. So I have not tried to flash anything yet, but I'm thinking that, you know, maybe later I'll figure all this out. But anyway, there's a little folder down here that pops up. And if I click on that little folder, you can see the icons that I get down here. Really, really small little icons. One that says browser. And if you open it, the browser comes up. And one that says camera. So you can actually, you know, it's facing down right now, but you can actually, you know, power on the camera there. And then, of course, one that says people. And that is what comes up for that one. And one that says phone. I'm just going to go through them all to show you guys because I've been playing around with it, trying to figure this out. <clears throat> Before I go into settings, there's one over here that says testing cam. So I'm gonna click on that. I found this one kind of interesting. So if you spin this around, this is what you get here. You know, um, if you turn, it says over here, like turn preview on, then, you know, you get this preview. Okay, and then there's one up here that you can touch that says, uh, info and of course you can scroll through all this stuff going on in the background so I found this pretty interesting so there are some other options here you can choose like 3d default you can go through and select different things here um, a preview size I can change the preview size and of course info and every time I turn the preview on or off you can see down there in the like little command window there it changes so I mean, it is exact to the exact time when I change it and stuff. So I, I thought that thing was kind of interesting. I don't know. And that's why I'm thinking this is like coming from the factory, like some type of testing software. Um, it actually adds recent down to the bottom there. So if I fling those away, get rid of those, you will see down here in this taskbar, they're gone now. So now if I go into settings, and go through some of the settings here you will see that one comes up that says Motorola ID under backup and reset if I check if I check click it there you can see what it says here need to identify you across devices cloud to provide you with the best possible experience so you get that and then if I go back if I continue down to the bottom to about phone of course, if I go into status, you can see I don't have anything. Everything's dead. Like, nothing exists. My phone does not recognize no networks or anything like that. But as you go down through this list, you see the model number there. The system information says Motorola Mobile Computing System. Android version 444. And then it has the kernel there. And of course, then it has <clears throat> the build number. Shamu Factory User Debug 444, something there. So very interesting of what's going on here with my phone. I don't know if anyone else has experienced this, but I thought some of us would find this interesting of things like this going on, this little thing down here that says testing cam. And of course you can click back, go back into settings, open the folder up and you get, so if you click on the folder, like I said, I don't know, I've never 
seen anything like this before. But then, I don't know if my phone will focus here. There it did a little bit. But testing cam, if that's a neat, it's just like a little camera icon and it's got some colors to it. So if you click it, I just found this one pretty neat, this testing cam. So, very, very interesting stuff. If any of you guys know what this is, like I said, let me know. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and have a great one.